today I'm going to be looking at this so a Sagan slash Discali branded ADSL modem from quite a few years ago. So this was in the days when sort of ADSL up to 8 meg services were the norm and to get those speeds was really quite lucky and many people even if they could get them couldn't afford to subscribe to them. So this was just the installation CD that came with it. So you can see there Tiscali's old sort of logo, which is internet with a passion. Um, obviously they're called Talk Talk now. There have been lots of acquisitions with various different companies since this was published. So you can see just the basic sort of contents there. And then just as we open it up, you can see there's the uh, CD there with just some basic instructions. And then this, is the installation CD ROM? So I'll just put that, put that back again, and that says copyright 2004. So it provides the age of this thing. Now, the modem itself is a Sagan Fast 800E3, which you can see there, and this is an 8 GDMT, fairly standard 8 meg, so what we would could would call that sort of ADSL Max in this country, sort of bog standard modem. Um, it's on the back you can see it's just USB and um, DS mail so basically phone line in so this is basically designed for one computer but the connection could be shared if you um, use internet connection sharing on your chosen computer so in that regard it looks fairly simple and based on the data sheet this came out around about 2002 Opening up is very easy, so you've got to peel the uh, tape back there and then take the screw out. It's sort of a specialist type, but a normal straight screwdriver uh, managed to do the job perfectly fine for me. And then it's just a case of sort of breaking the latches on the edges there. And then when you open it up, it's a very, very simple setup indeed. Um, so the board just flips out, it's a single side board, there's nothing on the other side. And then what we basically have is an analogue device is Eagle 3, which is part of a what they call sort of a two chip AESL modem solution. And as you can see, by and large, it is just a two chip solution, as they say. So basically what is you get the AESL line coming in there, a bit of filtering, you should get the primary connection chip there, and then you just get the USB controller, sort of interfacing device, which then connects to the USB out port there. So that's basically all that's in this, and it does it does kind of have a smell of semi-old electronics, but there's not really that much to speak about in that department. So it's basically just a really sort of basic uh, modem for the kind of broadband that you got at the time. I mean, we got it in a thing for about 2006 when we signed up for an um, up to probably two megabit per second ADSL line, which by today's standards for many people would be pretty diabolical, but in those days it was pretty good. But I guess what you probably want me to do is to install the software and kind of demo it a little bit, which is why I've got this Windows 2000 VM starting, although the software will work in Windows XP and I think possibly even beyond that. So you see I have the CD opened up here, so I just double click on Tiscali. Then this box appeared and it sort of shows the loading of their logo and obviously the internet with a passion business. So then we go install Tiscali Broadband and it probably just loads from one of the directories up there. But we'll see what happens. So yeah, we have all those things. So just press next. Oh god, I'm gonna stick all our details in. Obviously I'm not a customer, so I'm probably gonna to have to kind of fake this, but it's the modem's not gonna be connected to an actual line, so it should be alright. And yeah, no surprise it was perfectly happy with my made up details because obviously it doesn't it doesn't think it's even got an internet connection at this point. So right, connect the USB cable to your modem. Right, I've now done that and you can see all the um, sort of device thing popping up, so just press continue. Yeah, I've done that. Do, do, do. Right. Continue. 
do 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 done all that right finish there's some as I wish for us to connect obviously it's not actually going to be able to connect here but you you can see the yeah I've done John Smith thing there but you can see it it's not going to connect to it and obviously Windows thinks this is a dial-up connection which is kind of fairly humorous in some ways but and then you just get the so USB software wizard that you can sort of download as a standalone unbranded product at the same time but yeah that that's a look at this simple ADSL modem from some time ago